Oh, it's our math. Easy solution to discuss uh, how to recover deleted files from an external memory card. Uh, basically, using this free program I found online, PC Inspector File Recovery Program. Basically, my friend Sophia Velasco was actually last week. She actually accidentally deleted all of her uh, files off this memory card that she had for a couple of years, and she wanted to recover it. So I did a little investigation and found you could uh, do like basically recover this all. Because uh, when you delete a file, actually, most operating systems. Um, what they actually do is just delete the link to it. Yeah, so most of them only, so only the link to it, uh, they delete them. Well, what I mean by this is if you have, let's, this is your operating system or your computer you're using. Uh, let's say it's PC or Mac, uh, it doesn't matter. Usually it's like this, and then you, let's save a file inside, and then it's saved in your uh, memory here. This is this called this file, and then you delete this file. This one has an address here. Or on your drive, everything has an address. So all all this does, or it links either probably to the address, but it doesn't matter. So let's say when you delete it, all it does is delete this link. So this is this gets deleted. Let's say let's call this a link to it, to the file or to the address. So this gets deleted. So now the computer doesn't doesn't know where your file is anymore, and because this link is deleted, and then this file's still there. So it's uh, still there. And usually what happens is it's not usually deleted permanently unless the unless it's overwritten by saving another file on it and uh, this usually happens uh, when when there's no more space no more empty space because one considered it's occupied here no more empty space in the memory card usually how the operating system works so usually when you're maxing out it would write over uh, you, when you save more files and then it would basically write over the ones that have no link or that you deleted basically so then it would write over them and then they would be permanently deleted so right here, what this means is that that to fully yeah. So, so what this means is all we gotta do is find the link, and this is actually pretty easy. Yeah, so you could uh, recover the links or uh, the little files easily. Uh, but the problem here is if you have let's say personal or financial uh, information, and for that you want to delete it, uh, you would actually need to use another program. Uh, I'll do another math easy uh, video on on the program eraser. So if you actually want to delete it permanently, it's uh, you would actually have to have to uh, probably use a program or do something else to actually fully delete it. Yeah, otherwise, anyone could basically just all they need is a memory card, and then they could just go and see what you have uh, deleted before. So uh, we'll illustrate this by just opening the um, well PC. This one using PC file recovery. You could just uh, find this anywhere on uh, Google. Actually, just uh, you can. Yes, yeah, so all I gotta do is type in uh, PC Inspector File Recovery here. So then you could uh, search any one of these ones here. I usually pick the uh, CNET one here. And you could basically work around in this one. So you could just download it here and whatnot, and then it will open up like this. But I already have it downloaded. So CNET is uh, a good site usually to uh, download it for free. So I'll just, uh, but before that, let's just look at my um, my uh, external hard drive, my external memory card, and then uh, let's play around with it. Okay, so here's my just the, my computer here, and there's a removable disk here. This one and it's just a uh, two gig micro SD that I have for my uh, camera here. Let's just add a photo here that, and then we want to delete it. Let's just go with. Okay, let's just click over here, image here. Here's a funny Balotelli meme I had before. Okay, I just want to put it here. So now uh, Balotelli, uh, this is a graduation uh, I made here. He graduated and whatnot with his pose that he did with Team Italy. But, but anyways, uh, so let's say you wanted, you accidentally deleted this. And now the thing is, with this one, you can't undo because it's on your removable disk. So it's perm it seems like it's permanently gone, so, so it's lost here. But then we're using the PC inspector. We'll just open that up. Okay, so now if we open the uh, PC Inspector here, uh, just open uh, it's another window. So just all you can do is click on uh, just English language. Just one, just a bunch of stuff you could do here. Plus the info to learn more, or just well, now you don't need it right now. First basic stuff you can look at that further later. Basically, click on this one. This is the PC Inspector. Click on this. Let's just uh, rescan drives just so it get scans new one there because I just deleted now. And uh, you can go physical drive here. Just Click on this, go to deleted, and there it is. It was just it was an outer one. There's the bullet until he graduated one, which I just deleted. So you could just uh, save to wherever. Let's just go to um.
desktop. So it, it, by default, the desktop you can play around where it gets saved. So it's saved on my desktop, or I could just click on this one and go to desktop, and then let's just uh, details by name. There's the ball until I graduated one. So the one we just deleted, it's right there. So yeah, so that's pretty useful. You could also do this for full folders and whatnot. If you were to delete this entire folder, and then you could recover the whole thing back, or you could recover the entire SD card that was just deleted. But so uh, yeah, that's all for today. But then I'll show my another video using this program Eraser, which basically permanently deleted so that we can't get it back, or someone else can't. Especially this is useful for personal or, or financial info, like your financial statement. You, you don't want people looking at your credit card and whatnot, so you can have it personal. Uh, you get permanently deleted. Well, that's all for today. Hopefully you learned about deleting files. Oh, it's actually not deleted, so you don't have to worry too much here. And, uh, well, that's all for today. Hopefully you learned, and uh, stay tuned for another mad easy solution.